Hey guys, it's Cold Cold. We're back again today. We're here with Trail Makers. Now, today we're gonna make a bomber aircraft. It's just gonna be out of my head, nothing from real life at all. So let's get started. Now, I think what we're gonna use is this cockpit. Large aerodynamic cockpit, and I actually just got the airborne stuff, so let's actually see how this looks. What? This looks amazing. Okay, that's super cool. And another thing I might use is the new camera block for like a bomb camera. So let's get started with this. So, what we're gonna do first is make like a canopy. No, like make like the part that goes behind it. So I think what I'm going to do for that is I'm going to go like this. Maybe one more. And then basically like build a box. Now we're also going to try and make our own custom payload. Our payload is basically the bombs or rockets. So I think what we're going to use is this rocket thruster, a stick of dynamite, and a rock, and a one by one by two cone. I'm just going to strap it all together and fire away. But we are going to use, for, but the payload that we are going to use the whole thing is the bomb bay so yeah this is gonna build around it back to the build actually we're just gonna build around it like this We are gonna make this, but we are gonna make this jet powered, I think. I think we'll make it jet powered. As I actually have used the new prop in one of, in another build I was doing. And it's not that great when it comes to speed. But it can be used to make some cool looking planes. So I think we're gonna do this. Might also do something like this just to get it aerodynamic the one there and then the one up there just to give it some aerodynamics and now we now we can continue now i don't know what i'm gonna do with in here i don't know if i should put some stuff in here Actually, maybe I should start filling this with proportion, actually. But let's just go down and see what we can do. Okay, now this is actually getting huge, though. This is absolutely humongous. If we are gonna make some sort of plane with this, though, we are definitely gonna need. How about this? How about we just take out this stuff? We just take all of this out. And we do what we were gonna do earlier. I wanna see how this would look. Because, like, if we just take this out entirely. It might look cool. But just taking it out. Also, getting rid of. It's gonna take a long time. I'm just copy it straight. Just grab it all. This is just gonna take forever. And if we just like get rid of the extra that I wanted, this whole side. So just take that as well. Oh. 
this, like just destroy this. We're trying something new. Okay guys, we're trying something new. And now we just put this. Actually, that follows like this thing's sort of like look with this curves around and it just curves on the side. That actually follows it. So I think we're gonna use that. Let me just copy this um, So we're just gonna keep these pieces just in case I wanna do anything with them. I mean something with them. So the bomb bit is basically gonna be like a door that just opens up. So I think for that we're gonna build something inside of it, like this. And attach it to a block. And attach this. So I think the easiest way to do this would be by putting a one by four there. Or one by four like this. Or like this. Then we just open it. So let's run a quick test with that and see. So Let's at least what I'm gonna have as my bomb base. I think we'll do the bomb base as one. No, one would be like landing gear. Oh yeah, and another thing, we could use these wheels for landing gear. These landing wheels. These look super cool. A pair of landing wheels to fit under an airplane. Okay. So we'll use these as two. Let's see. If we get out of the first person, I would do two. Um, two? Nothing's happening. Oh, that's because those are stuck. Oh. What are we going to use that? Because we need something. Something that doesn't connect to anything at all. Oh, I know. So what we're going to do is we're just going to put a shield piece. Like opened a shield piece like this. And then make this longer. Oh yeah, but we also can't make it touch this. Okay. So that means we just have to make this taller. We'll use this instead. Because we just need to make it taller. So we'll do that. Wait. Technical difficulties. <laughs> and then... We're going to put this here. Put that there. All we need is something to go here. Like we just need a block. And this is not even the correct size, so we'll do a one by three. And the block that I'm gonna use is a It's actually the same block that I'm going to use to cover up this, which is actually this. Because I can do this with what? We don't know. We don't even need that. Just this. And now if I do two. Two? Oh, wait. Do I have two on both of those? Oh, I just need two on this one. Two. So how do they normally open though? No, we do this as two. And do like open it from like the bottom. Yeah, like that. Then it just drops the bomb. Bomb. Oh, this needs to be bigger. 
Okay, then let's just bring this up here. Like this rounded piece. I'm just building something because I'm focused. Take a rounded piece there and there, then just connect it up here. And also, I'm gonna actually use this piece because I don't use it that much at all. I hardly use it. And it works well. Oh. Come back. Come. Come back, please. Okay, then. Now all we need is the bomb bit. And now it should fit. But now my other question is, how am I going to get a camera block? Oh, I can just put it right here. Just put, oops, we just put two right there, because I, how do I do this though? I'm just gonna put two just to even out the weight. And I just got to actually see on the other side of the map, so, hmm. Let's put this. And now, for, oh boy, no. Put that in right here. So for when it opens. So now let's test if that actually works. So, open. Wait, what? What is that one? It's connected to this. Which is con- Oh! Is that why? No, they're moving that now. Why? Why is that happening? Like it's moving that for some reason. Is this connected to more than one block? No, it's not. Why can't I drop the bomb? I mean, if I drop the bomb right now, it's not going to be good, but... I didn't expect it at all. I didn't expect it all to die. What? Okay, then, so it's either that something has to be connected here. Oh, you're connected, aren't you? Okay, so how do I get something that doesn't connect at the sides at all? Something that does not connect at the sides. We could use a tube. Use this so that it doesn't touch anything. Now if we do it, yeah, and then the bomb. Yeah, I just saw the bomb drop. Yeah, I can see the bombs drop through it. If you look really closely at the screen, you can see when the bomb goes through the thing. So what happens when it looks like this? 
Well, I can actually see the bomb doors. But I can't actually see where the bomb's gonna drop. But I think it's better to put it in front. Right here. And just open and then left shift so that you can see. Because you're gonna know where the bomb is. Right there. Yeah, so we're gonna keep that. And just put wedges to. We're gonna put the best type of wedge. That's something that you always do. If you have like one. Because each of these wedges has a different amount of aerodynamics. Okay, so now we just have to fill this in. Now we have to see what thrust we're gonna use. Because we can either use. try to use propellers. Or we can use thrusters. Actually, I think we'll use these large jets. Because I haven't used them yet. So yeah, let's just finish filling in the insides and then we'll do it. Now, each of now the bombs have like a delay on them already, but I but I won't know when I can drop them. So I think I'm actually just gonna leave like an opening where I can see the bomb, like right there, or do this but make it glass, so I can just look down on top and see if my bombs are ready or not. Because if you do this. You can see it turns green when you can actually drop it. But I won't be able to see, so we're gonna keep it like that. Yeah, I think we'll use the large jets because I actually haven't actually used those. And they actually, um, those look really cool. I know they're like airliner jets, but I don't think that matters. We don't even have lift or drag yet. Right now we just have mass. And we are, we are not even that heavy yet. at the inside of the airline. Just make sure everything works. Oh no. So it got connected by a 1x2 or something because I only have 1x2s. Yeah, right there. 
it got connected here, which made it so that it couldn't move at all. So we will have to replace that with wedges. Like this. And just do that for... Because I'm not able to. So which one's the wedge? Okay, so the wedge starts from there. So this is one, two, three. This is one, two, three, four. So it starts from there. That. And then put this. So delete all of these. Now let's see, does it still work? Nope. Which means something else is connected. Oh, let me guess. This is connected to a wedge. Wait, no. Okay, let's see. If I just take this, does that work? Let's see. Yeah, so now it works. So that means we need to put all of these as wedges as well. So flip this way back. Okay, and now this can't fit. We need to have to use something else, so I'm gonna use this. Now I'll just take Here and there. There you go. Here, here's the wedges that I just put. I'm just putting some wedges. Okay, well, the entire back half is in this thing, so I can just put it. Is it? Let's put it on its side to see. Okay, then not correct. Okay, there's another thing that is not working correctly. Oh my! Ah, <sighs> it's gonna be a long day. There's a wedge there and there's a wedge there. Wait, so let me see. Oh, I just deleted the shield. Yep. This cannot be connected to anything, and I think it is connected to something. Not that. Not that. Wait, what? Where is it? There's a piece right here, and it's connected to this. Again, to put in a wedge right here. Now it's not touching anything, and then we can just go back in these. Because these don't matter. Yeah, now it works. Okay then. Now we need to add wings to this. I don't even know how I'm going to add wings to this. I 
thing's huge, though. Let's see. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna do these two by twos. And then put it like there. And I want the wings near like the center. And this is one, two, okay, so put it here. Some huge wings. Now I wonder, should I make my wings sweep forward or should I make my wings sweep backward? We'll make it sweep backward. So just wait, let's change this. Run them all the way down. Or from like here. Like that. So first, let's just put down the end. Whoa, okay, these ends are absolutely massive. We haven't looked like put them on the edge of the wing. Or should we put them like this? Yeah, that would look kind of cool. Yeah, that would look like super cool. Yeah, we're gonna do that. I just noticed how big these engines are. Just take off the swing and put on this one. My center of lift is super far. Now for this, I'm actually going to need makeshift ailerons. So let's just actually fill in the gaps though. So one... We're gonna put our makeshift ailerons here. And said makeshift ailerons are actually just small elevator fins. Oh no, we'll put the small elevator fins right here. And we're gonna need more than one. There's actually gonna be a lot of elevators. We're gonna put one, two, three. I'm hoping this is gonna be enough thrust. Now 
just going to put this. Our absolutely massive entrance. This is crazy, actually. Like, this thing is huge. Like, that thing is like half my plane. And the plane's not even that big. Actually, I think we might just cut off some of this. Just stick the entire thing on. So we're just gonna delete all of this. And put... Okay, just connect these. You know, no, put a wing. Just gonna put a modular wing. You can connect it by shield. Um, I'm gonna put this. I might need more thrust, so I might actually just attach this by putting one of these. I might as just put another engine on it. So one of those, a one by four. to put on the exact same spot so in the middle of these and then we're gonna put another end because I don't think this will be enough but let's see first actually this is a lot what So we need. Where's the ma machine that I made in here? Where's it? Get that. Just like that, and that to 90 degrees. have that which looks cool and the weird thing is this thing doesn't even have a tail yet and it's working oh my gosh i'm still blowing myself up i think i might need to move the bombs back because i keep on hitting stuff we're gonna put that there a lot of dress. I didn't expect it to be this much dress. Oh no. All of those pieces just did that. Why does this keep happening? 
I don't need those pieces. I actually think it's this. That's probably touching it. Yeah, that was touching it. I think this is gonna be it. I think we might just make this a part one, not part two. So yeah. Bye guys. This is the end of part one of me making this bomber plane. So this is gonna be part one and we will continue part two next time. Bye. Bye. And don't forget to like and subscribe.